Hi guys, sorry for being a little late. Um, as you can hear, my toddler is having a full on melting temper tantrum. She was with grandma last night and she was at the water park for about an hour or two. And I think she just got really, really overtired. And yeah, so um, as you can hear, she's in the background crying. Um, yes, it's, it's, it's been one of those days. She had a nap and then she woke up. And of course, when they wake up, they're always so cranky, aren't they? Like, okay, so just want to. See if I can share this. So you guys are going to hear her screaming for a little bit. I apologize. She's just not happy today. I'm hoping she will calm down quite a bit. Just in a few minutes. Um, you would have to go to the Jeffree Star um, video and uh, you would have to watch that to enter. So it might be a little late. Um, yeah, so I am good. Oh, <laughs> she had about a two hour nap today. So that's what <laughs> really put her over. And I let her. Um, I just got off. I just, I was supposed to work evenings yesterday, but I ended up being asked to go in for nights. So I got up around 1230 today after getting off at seven. So um, I'm tired and I thought I'd snooze on the couch a little bit, but I could not. Um, so hello, everybody. If you are new here, welcome. Um, if you guys can make sure you hit the like button, that does help me out a lot. I did get my thousand subscribers, so I am doing my... Um, Picking my giveaway winners, um, the Jeffree Star one just exploded. It has like 27, um, uh, 27,000 views, yeah, 20, 2,700 views. Sorry, thank you. I love my, I love my ink too. It's something, it's funny. I never got, I got my first tattoo when I was like 30, and uh, my mom says to me, Well, I guess you can't rob banks or commit any crimes. I'm like, um, mom, I have a giant birthmark on my face. I'm pretty sure that would give me away. But yeah. Um, so yes, thank you guys so much for helping me out. I truly appreciate it. And everybody that is here today, I think the camera is a little off today. I'm not sure if it's because um, it's darker in here or what. I know um, outside it's starting to look a little stormy. Okay, so I thought I would do this today and we would get ready and then um, towards the end of the video, we will do the winner. So, oh, as you guys know, BoxyCharm is what, $25 a month plus $5 to ship to Canada. This month is called Fantasy. I'm not so sure, but look at the packing they did. Like... I do actually have Twitter. Um, I think it's at Rocks Rock. Okay. Don't know what that is. Okay. Okay, so this was my choice. Yes, it's been hot here too. Today it was like 26, but it felt so much worse. 
Okay, so you know what? Everything did come in one piece. Look at those colors. Aren't they beautiful? So this is a whole face palette. Good to go. Oh, yes. So if you hear my daughter, she's not being tortured. She's just with daddy. And of course you, uh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> um, some of it, it's really weird. You can actually see the outline of it now. Um, this actually, I did the doll time TCE and the um, coverage. I wanted to show you the different coverage. Um, hi, Kelly. Uh, Yes, a lot of makeups do cover it, but when you're in person, you can definitely see it. Okay, so this is valued at $39. Um, okay, so the next item I have is Bella Pierre Liquid Black Eyeliner. Like, I always thought that BoxyCharm should be going for higher end products, especially at $25. This is valued at... $20. I don't know anyone who buys Bella Pierre. I don't. I'm going to just leave that over here. Okay, so the next item I have is this pen pal, four in one makeup pen for when you need. So I think this idea is neat. I've seen it in a few things. So. Okay. So one is supposed to be for an eyebrow. One is a black eyeliner. One is a highlighter. And then I think one of these is supposed to be purple, but I'm not sure which one. Well, that one's black. Or maybe it's brown. I don't know. Okay, that one's brown. So what is, um, is this one? Yeah. D do you know what you got, Martine? Did I, did you send me the photos? I can't remember. That's supposed to be mauve. We need to have a conversation with them. They don't really seem like it. I'm okay with getting this because this is a brand that I've never tried. I think this is a unique product. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. That is really nice. Yeah. Like, it might not, maybe not even so much high-end, but a lot of indie brands. Um, um, I, you know what I mean? Like, I, I, I kind of am interested to trying this. I don't usually do eyeliner on line but uh we'll maybe give it a try tonight so this is out crease retinol trifecta serum from dermalect now i can't hate too much on this brand because i do know that um seriously why do we have such a big box for this like maybe it's just for extra cushion i don't know so um this is valued at, so the this is valued at $25. That is still quite a bit. Um, this is valued at $39. Um, this is, a, find this brand a lot in FabFitFun. Um, yeah, Vanessa, we might have. Um, I think I've seen a lot of variations like this. Um, and then I get this Mudski. And this is valued at $63. And this is supposed to be eye stuff. Now it says wash your hands and face. I find that funny that they're like your hands as well. But I mean, when I'm washing my face, my hands do get... Uh, yeah. So, um, so it's hundred and sixty some dollars. I was kind of hoping to get the flower 
setting powder because then I could say I'm baking. <laughs> and my mom's here tonight. So, okay, so I'm going to get this started. Um, these are really gorgeous. Now, Vanessa, you got, got yours already. Have you like done a look with this? Oh, yeah, uh, WPG girl. Um, it's been a while since I've seen you, and I cannot f seem to remember your, your name. I should know this. Um, oh, no, look, yeah, okay. So there's, like, the shimmers are gorgeous, but I want to play with this one. So maybe I'll just do a very simple look. This one looks like it's got sparkles in it. Um, I don't mind Ofra. I know the highlighters are absolutely uh, great. Now, I move things around so you're in front of me and my, um, uh, my um, mirror is over to here. So I will warn you guys, I'm on like five hours of sleep, so I will forget um, almost every word that's going to come out of my mouth. So you're going to hear a lot of ums and... What was I saying? So I apologize now. And I'm hoping that the little one calms down so when I do go upstairs, her and I can go to sleep. Although she just had a two-hour nap, so she's probably not going to go to sleep. Yes, um, it's been a while since I've had an Ofra palette. Now, I do know that the highlighters are absolutely amazing. Um... When I saw this, I was like, hmm, should I get it? Shouldn't I? And I'm like, you know what? That green just, it took me in. So I'm just like, there's no, oh yeah, there's shades at the back. Okay, so I'm thinking this should be ready. And this one would be clean slate, or is this ready and this is clean slate? I do like the fact that, like, they leave it so that you can take them out and you can put them back in the way you want them. I think that's an absolutely amazing idea. It gives uh, the whole new meeting to, um, uh, you know, customizing your palette, which I do like. So I'm going in easy with this color because it looks bright. It is bright. Yeah. I don't know if the chat just stopped or if there we go. It's very, very bright. <laughs> and I knew it was going to be like that. I knew it. <laughs> Well, I can tell you this has some pigment packed into it. That's for sure. This is a beautiful color, though. I will say that. Gorgeous. Think she's coming down okay so i'm going to go in with the green just want to do something simple i want to play with this pe alley oop pen i want to see if this will look at that
Look at the shimmer on this. I'm going to have to bring some like water over with me like that I can dip. Yeah, like look at that green. I know I was playing with the green the other day and I had to kind of build it up a bit, but this one, whoo. That is gorgeous. I was, I'm going to have to write to box and be like, seriously, you put in a piece of paper, you're lucky that things didn't break. I can't believe that. Just a piece of paper. I'm canceling with them. Um, I don't know if you guys see any spoilers for next month. There is just, it's just not worth it to me. So I'm going to go in with this pink red here. And I'm going to try to use this as a blush, even though this is like, whoa. Let me know when you do a look, Vanessa, because I would love to see it. And anyone else that does a look, I would love to see it. So you can tag me on Instagram if you don't mind posting it, or you can just send it to me privately. You know, just let me know what you got. I have so many palettes, though, that sometimes it's hard to, get, to reach for one again and again. But, I mean. I know it's hard. The, this palette is beautiful, but some of the colors are, um, like, kind of random. Like, the green is very random in this, but I kind of like it because it is a bit of pop of color. Do this on one of your days where you're just feeling really good about life. I saw the look that I think you did today or yesterday, Vanessa, and it was gorgeous. I think I liked the photo and I meant to comment something, but uh, I don't think I did. So I'm going to go in with the the, the, uh, the silver here. I mean, it's just too pretty not to play with it. And I've got almost all the colors. I like to use a third color for a transition. I think that's a little bit nicer than just, you know. But that's just me. Okay, guys, I want you to rate my box by how many stars you would give this to BoxyCharm. I'm not 100% sure. I do, don't do mind the two uh, non-makeup items, and I don't mind these two. So I think I would give it maybe a three, maybe a four, because the, the only thing that's saving it is the um, Mudski, but I find that that's just an overinflated price. And I think this does definitely help. I love to see more offer products, especially their highlighters, because the highlighters are amazing. An amazing formula. One thing I like about them is that when I do wear them, I find that um, it doesn't, like when I put, apply it, it doesn't take off my... Um, Okay. Thanks, guys. Okay, I was, like, just trying to be a little bit nice, but like, I don't want to put anyone down who did love this box. I mean, if you love this box, then let me know. I always find it, like, you know, a little disheartening when you find that you really like a box, and then everyone else is like, oh, it's crap, and I'm like, no. Yeah, I, I'm definitely canceling. I think this isn't a bad look. What do you guys think? Like, do you think it match like it, it kind of goes together? I love this green. Oh my gosh. And this like silver. Oh. Okay, where's this thing here? So I'm gonna put the mauve under. I know somebody was saying, um, I like that, Chrissy, actually. 
So somebody was saying that theirs was really dried out, and I'm not finding that at all, at least on the back of my hand. Oh, you staying for the August box? So what do you, what are you guys excited for for the August box if you are staying staying there? Um, I've heard of the brand Tower Twenty Eight, but I have not tried it. And that's one thing I'm not liking about BoxyCharm is the amount of variations, and it seems like the the variation in value is really fluctuating. I know I had an issue with my um premium last month like I got the Marc Jacobs uh uh mascara which don't get me wrong I like the Marc Jacobs uh mascara I've got a bunch of dog hair on my screen um I like the Marc Jacobs mascara but I saw everyone else getting the same box with a 63 $60 palette and I'm like yeah, no, that that's not fair. Like, give me a little bit more than that. You do have a little bit of fallout right there. Ah, you have a lot more followers on um, Instagram lot than I do, so. So I'm just putting that silver right in here, or champagne color. And then, I think this is the brown. Yes. <laughs> Uh, I'm an ally, and I think that it's very important. Oh, you're not late yet. You haven't drawn the, the name yet, so welcome, guys. Thank you guys so much for joining. I'm just going to... I'm really bad at doing the pencil one, so... I am going to say, like, I... Oh, <sighs> that fell off. Okay, I do see what people are saying. I do like this idea, and uh, so the mirror is Jeffree Star. It is the um, it is the Pride collection. I was really hoping to get the sweatsuit, and it sold out before I could. And he's got a new collection coming at the end of the month. So, I'm going to save all my dollars for it. Have you got your shipping notification yet, um, Kelly? I know I haven't. A lot of people are getting theirs, but I ordered the mini too. Oh really? Like the like is it like sold out? I I know on Beautylish it is, but I didn't realize like it's uh yeah. Okay, so definitely I think I really like this. I think I'm gonna rate it like a four stars because it did um rip a little bit, but the eyeliner went on really well. Um, oops, that's right there. Oh, okay, so I am gonna go in. This one. With that orange kind of underneath. So the only color I'm not sure I'm gonna try, uh, use is that, um, bronzer. I'm gonna maybe just try it a little bit on my here oh 
Okay, Yvette, how, what boxes did you get? And Chrissy, how come how come you're not allowed to? I'm really hoping that's not my dog getting into something. The Beautylish one, I, I'm not going to lie. I got a second one. I won a little bit of money, and I did get it. I wanted to go big because of the mirror. I don't have an exclusive mirror, really, so I really, really wanted to get it. Um, I'm not sure what's going on. Caleb? Is that you? I have a ghost in my house. Hello? Sasha? That was you. Sasha? Lay down. Lay down. You're being a bad girl. I know you are. Oh, ouch. Lay down. No. Come here. Lay down. You're being a naughty girl. Okay, down. I said lay down. You're being a bad girl today, aren't you? Come on. Sorry, guys. I'm guessing somebody left something out. Out. Oh. Oh, it, it sounded like somebody was getting into something and I, and Sasha's pretty good about not getting into things. So this one has two different brushes. I love that. Okay, so last night, Lucas and I watched the new Fear Street. Has anybody seen the new Fear Street movies that are on Netflix? And yes, I think somebody's outside of my window with... Uh, Yeah, I, I, a lot of my stuff went into the giveaway. But you know what? That's okay, because I still got I got a mirror, and I got some things, and I think it was still worth it for me. It also pushed me over the thou uh, yeah, thousand. <laughs> I have two mirrors. So this is my favorite mirror. I love, as you guys can see, peppermint. It's my favorite. I've been trying to track down the peppermint frost from Jeffree Star because it came out before. So I also have the baby ColourPop one. Um, and then all of my other ones are over there. But I do have this one out, which is the one that I am giving away. This isn't the one I'm giving away. This one's mine. But it is in the giveaway. And I could pull out a, a couple other ones. Um, but... We're not going to do that today. Nobody needs to see how neurotic my collection actually is. <laughs> okay, so let's... I'm afraid of this. This looks like it's going to be a bit much. Oh, maybe not. That actually isn't bad. And it look, it's not even taken off my makeup. Usually by now it looks a little... Um... Yeah, 
Yes, I got the exact same thing, Yvette. And I don't have shipping yet. And I live here in Canada. And it will take a lot longer. Wow, I'm impressed with this. Um, I have to admit the Fear Street movies have been pretty interesting. I love horror movies. Horror movies are my thing. Love them. And um, if you guys don't know, I actually work right now housekeeping at my local hospital. I mean, it's super tiny. There's like maybe not even 3,000 people here. Um, uh, so, yeah, um, it's really super tiny, but I swear there's a ghost in the building. And I love it. I think that uh, it's friendly. He or she is friendly. And they're just, you know. Spending their time. Well, we had a new security guard last night, and I was uh, kind of teasing him about it. I think he scared him. <laughs> I dumb or scary, but I do not like the scary movie thing. Like I don't like um, like that franchise. I find it just too too gross. Um, but gross humor, and I'm like, nah. I fall asleep to scream all the time. Lucas is like, how do you do that? It, people are screaming. I'm like, what? So, yes. Um, whoa, I think this might... Look at that, guys. Um. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that sounds so funny. Um, we're letting people back in that are vaccinated. So, if you're vaccinated, you can come on over. From what I understand, the last time I looked at the... Um, the news. Let me get my Hocus Pocus one out and try this foundation or foundation blush. So yeah, I um I sometimes at night uh, on my break I'll watch like a scary movie or um <clears throat> I listen to podcasts about murder and mayhem and yeah. And I'm like, I really shouldn't be doing this, but yeah, I was a little bit older. I was about 17 when I first sat, sat down. I was always afraid of everything, and you know, jumping in my, sh you know, at my own shadow. Still do it. But. Whoa. Okay. So. This is used. Doesn't look like it. So I added that highlighter right here and it is gorgeous and I will be but it's, that's my sister-in-law's wedding and I'm so excited for it I literally like have the whole week off all of the other shindings that I had have been canceled and it's just like no stop canceling things so people have gone off to be, you know, eloped and they're married and they're going to wait for things to open up and then they're going to start partying, which is fine with me. And I got it. Like, it's so hard when you've got this whole thing planned out and all you want to do is, you know, party with every, you know, your friends. <laughs> so my dad actually watched um, Robocop when I was like six too and I had nightmares I actually just recently rewatched that whole series yeah it's still one I can't stomach I used to love Astro Boy and then I found out the um the behind like the story behind it and I no longer like Astro Boy <laughs> I know it sounds really silly oh my gosh guys this highlighter like it is gorgeous. I'm going to take that pink. This look turned out way better than I expected. Um, the Possession of Michael Caine. I don't know if I've seen that one. I'll have to check that one out. Um, one of the ones I really liked was, um, was it? I think it was called The Strangers, and it's based in the U.S., and it's, 
mom's, I think, mother's home with her kids and somebody comes in and basically murders them all and there's like one kid that's left living and it's because he's not their kid, he's somebody else. Um, and it's based on a true story. That's what makes it scary to me. Not gonna lie. Yeah, like that turned out really well. And look at that highlighter. That is just, whew. I'm gonna put everyone out of business doing that. I do, I, I do. Um, now, I don't have cable, so I'm not able to see it. Right now, um, the first one was one of my favorites. Um, and then the circus one. Um, they actually have Scream out on a on the um, out on Netflix, and it has the first three seasons. Season four is supposed to be released soon. It hasn't yet, guys, and it is driving me crazy. I think it should be released. It's one of the um, better uh, movies. Let's see here. Who is this one here? You know what? I'm gonna go. There's still some colors I haven't really used in here. Oops. Coven, yes, yes. Oh yes, that one was great. Um, Screen Queens. I actually watched that one, and uh, yeah, I'm actually gonna go in with Rose Matter because um, if you guys know um, Stephen King, he actually has a book called Rose Matador. And every time I think of Rose Matter, I think of Rose Matador. Um, yeah, ah. There's another one um, that I really, really liked. And I think of all the time in it. They're in an apartment building. And... Um, Every season, it's a different, like two different killers. And the first season, I think, is where they're in an apartment building, and um, they're killing off the residents. I have started watching that, and then I stopped. I don't know why I stopped, but I think I just had too many shows. Uh, the new Nancy Drew on um, CW. It's not as scary as. Uh, just the plot on it is amazing. And I grew up watching Nancy Drew, so. Um, oh, I wish I wish I knew what that that um, one was, and this it's sort of like Scream, but it's not. And um, yeah, every season's a different scenario and a different a murder spree. Army of the Dead. This smells so good. Definitely a brighter pink than what I was expecting, but I actually think it suits. Yeah, I, you know, I watched it too, but, um, because it has Skeet Alterich, uh, who is the killer in Scream. Um, it makes me feel old. <laughs> it also has, um, what's her, what is her name? From uh, 
the 16 movies. Oh. I think I watched it up until like the second or third season when Betty went all weird and I was like, I don't know if I can do this anymore. They shot Archie's dad. I think he, um, I think he ended up passing away in real life. I can't remember now. Yes, I have seen It Follows. Um, the one I just watched recently, I wish I remembered what it was called. It's a brand new one, and it's on Amazon Prime. So I'm going to say this probably saved the whole box. This saved the whole box. I'm gonna not going to lie. This seems like... It's not boxy charm quality. Um, it's obviously something they had a lot to uh, a lot to go with. I do like the the fact that you can take this out and repot them, and it does look weird, doesn't it? Like that green just stands right out at you, and you're like, "How am I going to make a look with these?" But you can. I mean, I think I did a good job. Maybe not the best, but I mean, something simple, something unique. It's all right there. So it's, I have a wedding to go to. Like, I'm definitely taking this with me because then I can do touch-ups with it. Now, they did say you can actually use this as, like, the mauve, like, uh, or the black as um, on your lips. So it does uh, does work on a little bit of everything. I'm just going to try to clean up a little bit here. Um, now, uh, I did not do my brushes because I went to work. Yeah. Silliness. Why does work have to get into the middle of everything? Right? Okay, guys. I really, really like these lives. Um, so maybe maybe we can just do one day a week. Um, obviously, I'm not going to do uh, two in a couple of days, <laughs> especially with working and whatnot. Um, but, uh, you guys can see most of my application this way. I had to throw a little Jeffree Star in it. If you guys ever get a chance and you want to start with something small from Jeffree Star, a mirror, I'm going to say... Do I have something on my mirror? I do. Um, a mirror is a great investment or a lip gloss. A lip gloss is really great. He even has like the clear ones. I don't know. They are a little expensive, but these are seriously some of my favorite lip glosses. Oh, no. Oh, Chrissy, you're the one that said that you were. Oh, yes. I am so, so sorry. Um, like I won't be doing too many more lives anyway, but, uh, do you have a pride mayor? Oh, um, I really like the way that it's making it pop. Corners, a kiss. I, I have nudist colony. That's the one I have. And look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I don't know if you guys can actually see the color. And that would have actually would have been really nice to do tonight. It looks brown, but it's actually like um, a nice soft mauve pink. I don't know if you guys can see that. But oh, yeah. I actually have um, the two from Shane Dawson. Or no, one from Shane Dawson, and um, this one was in the mystery, and I love the mystery one. So it's black, as you can see that I actually had another lipstick on, but um, it's very clear, and I love it. Love it. So this is why I tend to go for the mystery boxes, because some of these items I wouldn't get normally, so the, this is just the lip balm. Um, 
I also find that it is a lot of bang for your buck, but if you have a lot of his collection, um, it's not really worth it to you. Um, for me, I find that it is. I can't go and buy um, every single one of his Supreme glosses, which, man, I would love to. I know. I wish they did. Yes. Um, I haven't watched the series on Shane, and um, I really, really would like to to do that. Um, just to, to let you guys know, I know we talked a lot about Doll 10 in the last video. Um, you can use the link and still use a different code. If you use my link, I still get like the credit for it, but uh, you can use a different code because they do have different codes. And sometimes if you... Um, log in and you create your account or whatever they will send you a code for like 15 to 20 percent off um yeah and i think actually my code is now even though it says 15 i think it's for 20 percent off i um just got uh just got some, um an email and i was looking at stuff and it said that the person got 20 percent off so that's pretty awesome um they do have some really, really great products. So again, the code is Roxanne 15. If you just go to the site, if not, you click on the link. Um, and if you make a purchase within the 30 days of you clicking on that link, it'll automatically track it. I know I would love to meet him too, but at the same time, like, um, I think I have the beaded glass. I'm actually really surprised. I got, um, quite a few of the, um, nude shades and i'm like those are some of my favorite like this gold one here is just absolutely stunning and i think this is safe word yeah it's just stunning just just stunning oh and you know what yeah i have the heaven's gate now i did buy this and this is one of another one that's really really nice you can put it on everything yeah, I've got quite a few of the, I have a few other things in this one too. Body count, tabletop, he just has weird names, a mouthful, yeah. And I think this is the key. control freak. Oh. Yes, this is candy drip. Now, this one is actually in this. I actually wear the light, fair light. Um, and I barely have any setting powder on, and uh, it isn't like it's not creasing through here, which is kind of nice. Um, I will say that um, you only need a little bit of the product, it does go a long way. If, um, as, and you can see that it's not. Uh, showing my age spots or the sunspots or whatever they are. Um, it's not selling in my fine lines like it usually does. Um, yeah, so I I really like them. Um, okay, so let's uh, do this draw because we're getting towards the one hour. I thought I had that one, but I guess I don't. Um, so I'm going to get the comments from the YouTube video. We have 75 comments, guys. That is the highest I've gotten for a giveaway. Now, with this being said, I'm going to pack this up and ship it out tomorrow. I still have the Supreme coming in and anything that's doubles will go into a giveaway for that. I have a second beauty lish bag that is coming in. And again, that is going in to a giveaway. Um, I'm also thinking about, uh, like if, um, with, he's got a new launch coming at the end of the month. Maybe I'll pick up most likely not a palette because the palettes are pretty expensive. I mean, they're quality, they're good, they're amazing, but, uh, maybe I can pick up a, a, a lip product or, uh, something else and, um, I can do just a standalone giveaway with it. Um. I know, Deepak, I know, 
But let's see who wins, and we'll go from there. I did say that this was only going to be open to Americans and Canadians, but I do want to see who wins, and we're going to go from there. We'll see how much it is to ship. And, you know, I do feel awfully guilty about doing that just because I, I'm on a limited budget as well, but you guys have been such great, great supporters and so loving and so caring and so nice that it's hard for me not to say no. I am going to do the giveaway right now. Um, if you guys like me doing the live giveaways, I'll keep doing them like that. Um, but I'm going to maybe go down to doing a live once a week or um, maybe uh, once every two weeks. Um, I hope Chrissy, yeah, Chrissy's still here. So, uh, yeah. And if I speak too fast, just let me know. I have been known to speak too fast and my mom will tell you that. Yeah. Number game, yes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, damn well, no, I'm going to buy every spot in that one. <laughs> yes, if you guys can make sure you give this video a like. Okay, are we ready, guys? I'm excited for this. Okay, so there's 75 comments. Can you guys see that? Did it go? There it goes. Oh, hold on. Can you guys see who that is? Oh, Rebecca. Rebecca Carroll. She says, I haven't been able to get the cremated palette yet, I, but I love it. Your eye look is so pretty and, your and, and so is your daughter. I'm happy I came across you. I like, shared, and I'm a newly subscribed. Fingers crossed for giving back. Instagram is Becca Carroll. Okay, Rebecca, you got this. I, is, was, she, was she here? I don't know if she was here. I'm sorry that you guys didn't win, um, but it sounded like she she really, uh, yeah, like she was excited to, to do this, and I'm excited to give away. I'm sorry, Rebecca. But maybe I can do something else. I mean, I still have more palettes coming in, and I'm only missing a couple of them. So unless I get blood, is it blood money, blue blood, um, or androgyny, <laughs> uh, I will be giving those away. Um, okay, guys, I am coming up to an hour, and it has flown by. And honestly, I'm going to go upstairs and have a shower, but I really like this look. I feel like I got it nailed down. So I'm going to go take a bunch of selfies. And I know it's so funny I work, I, when I work, work or I'm out and I want to show um, a really nice picture of my daughter, I have to scroll past all of me. And I'm like, I'm not really this vain. I just like makeup. <laughs> like, please don't look. <laughs> but. I'm sorry, Chrissy. I am sorry, Christina. Uh, Katrina, sorry. Um, I do apologize for you guys not winning. You guys have been awesome supporters, but keep watching because I will have more to give away. I love to give away. It gives me such high to give away. Um, yes. And maybe I will be lo looking into doing a skincare giveaway because I have way too much of that too. Um, and I also have the Barbie palette from ColourPop that I do want to do a giveaway. So maybe I will work on that next week anyway guys i hope you guys have a great week i should be back in the uh in the next couple days uh with a new video so keep uh an eye out for that um let me know if you guys want to see a jeffree star video or maybe um well i've got my beauty list coming in i do have some jacqueline hill or an anastasia look that i'm gonna have planned to do so anyway guys thank you so much for watching i really appreciate everything um yeah, don't forget to give the video a like. You can give this one a, sh a, a, a share uh, and make sure you're subscribed. Bye, guys. <laughs>